Monsignor Murphy has nominated me for Catholic Woman of the Year. Why are you whispering? I'm still in church. It's a sin to boast. As you all know, both Eileen Cleary and Agnes Dunn have been nominated. Every time something good is about to happen to me, Agnes Dunn pops up. The blood of Christ. You know you're a shoe-in. How do you figure that? Agnes Dunn's cousin married a Protestant. It's so important the home visit goes well to ensure you're our choice. You are not married and over 30. Is that a new sin I'm not aware of? No, I just think it would be nice if you told the committee you were dating a good Catholic man. Angela and I are getting married. It's the gays that are trying to indoctrinate our children. My daughter is a lesbian and Frank's a drunk. You think the church wouldn't approve of them? Every time we say goodbye, My cousin owns the real estate office just right across the street from Teresa Hennessy's salon. She said that she saw Frank Jr. there nearly every day this week. Some bag lady staring at us. Oh, Jesus, please. Help our son, Frank Jr., to stop being an idiot and go back to his wife and children. She's older than you are. You can't even have a midlife crisis, right? I'm just trying to be happy, Mom. Well, who cares if you're happy? You're living in sin. Says who? The Pope. What do you think? I don't have to think. I'm a Catholic. I made a lot of mistakes. Well, we all struggle from time to time. What if it's all the time? Our family is falling apart. I can't live like this anymore. This year, we are particularly blessed to be honoring someone who embodies both faith and family. Will you stop kicking me? Will you stop being a jerk? Hey, you stop kicking him. You stop being a jerk.